The sun finally arrived on day four of the Coca-Cola Kaimajola Cricket Week and it was game on for all the boys looking to leave their mark. Border took on a tough eastern side and sent the men from the East Rand into bat. Left arm quick and Gazi Seguili made early inroads, clean bowling for Ketso Mokwena with the new ball. Eastern skipper Yuri Snaman then looked to bat his side out of trouble with a half century before he also fell to Seguili who finished with 4 for 17 as Easterns were dismissed for 142. Our main plan was just to get Yuri in because we knew he was like the main guy so our plan was to get him in earlier. Border then calmly chased that down to win by 8 wickets with a 52 from Batandwa Isaac, the highlight of the innings. With SA Under-19 coach Ray Jennings and the other selectors looking on, this was the time to shine. It is difficult, but the selectors that are involved are obviously aware of players uh, throughout the year. And, uh, you know, we hopefully we, we, we watch enough cricket from, from now until the end of the week to actually make the right calls. Eastern Province seemed to have a defendable 211 on the board against Gauteng, thanks in large part to a well-played 67 by Murray Leith. In response, the Gauteng top order were sublime, chasing down the score with a brilliant 127 run partnership between skipper Yassine Valley and Grant Wolofsson. Valley played a great supporting role and passed 50, but it was the 99 from Wolofsson that really stood out. It took an incredible return catch from Bradley Bach to remove the opener, who fell agonizingly one run away from the century. I've never really been one to be nervous in the 90s. Um, I like to know when I'm in the 90s, but nah, I wasn't too nervous today, it's just uh, one of those things. Western Province faced local side KZN Coastal on Kersney College's main oval and chose to bat first. Opening pair Matthew Christensen and Clyde Fortain didn't disappoint with a massive century stand. Fortain continued to blossom and went on to score a terrific 123 in his team's total of 290. Yeah, it's been a while since I scored 100. Uh, as you know, I got out of 99, 19 in India, so I've been getting starts and I haven't been getting, like, I haven't been kicking on. So it just felt good today to just get the 100. So it feels like the monk is off my back now. The KZN boys made a fist of things with the bat, but their chase suffered a major setback when Luke Schlemmer was dismissed for 53 by Ulisa Mona. KZN Coastal Tail wagged, but a final run out ended things for the hometown lads to give Province a 42 run win. Elsewhere, Namibia stunned Free State to claim a 29 run win, while KZN Inland were defeated by an impressive and Pumalanga outfit. Northwest were able to hold off southwestern districts, while Northerns and Griquas defeated Borland and Limpopo, respectively. We're all set for a thrilling day five with the matchup between Gauteng and Western Province the main attraction.